Welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Kelvin Johnson. In this video, I'm going to show you how to add um, an SSD disk on a Windows 11 virtual machine. So let's say you've installed Windows 11 device on your virtual machine. You can see this actually installed on a SATA disk. So I want to add an extra disk to this machine, but not actually a SATA, but a, an SSD disk, which of course is more faster than a SATA disk, that is just your solid state drive disk. So if I go to edit virtual machine, and under the edit virtual machine settings here, you can see we have uh, we have a hard disk, which at this moment is SATA, and you can see we can actually do some configuration like the defragmentation, expand, and even compact the disk. But I want to add a new disk. Here we can actually click the hard the hard disk and then click next here we're going to actually go for the nvme which is a non-volatile memory express so i'm going to say next here we have the option to actually create a new virtual disk use an existing virtual disk or we can use a physical disk for sales for advanced user but i want to create a new virtual disk so just click next at this moment you can see it says we're going to create a 60 um, gigabyte or we can just go for 50 gigabyte of disk space so it says we have the option to allocate all this space now allocating the full capacity can enhance performance but requires all of the physical disk space to be available right now or we can actually split split the virtual disk into multiple files so which means that when you are moving these files it's actually to another device is but may reduce performance which is with very large disk so it's more easier actually to move but at the same time when you are using this it's your disk gets fuller when you use a disk instead of allocating all the disk space so i'm going to actually go to split my virtual disk into multiple files so i'm going to click next so now if we ask where do we want to save that file so i want to actually browse to a location where i want to save the file i'm going to go to my c drive and i'm going to go to my temp folder on my temp folder, I'm going to actually save this under this location. Let me just call this my, um, let me call this virtual disk 01. And I'm going to save it here. So I'm going to save it to that location and then click finish. And here we go. You can see the disk has just been created and then click OK. So when you click OK, we're going to power on this virtual machine and then see if we can see our disk or not. So when you restart your device and to actually if i go to let me just open file explorer because i've already added that there's the 50 gigabyte of disk here you can see that i'm not seeing that disk we just added so what we can do is I'm, i can go to disk management by going to disk management here you can see we have you can see say you must initialize a disk before logical disk manager can access it so we can just decide to actually just click ok and here you can see uh, this at this moment we don't have any um, it's this space our disk is still unallocated uh, unalloc so i can decide to allocate this disk let me just give it the e drive and i can give this disk a name let me just call this software click next and click finish so by clicking by doing that this disk is now being formatted and you can see at this moment the disk is we can now access that disk add files or software to that disk you here you see it's still coming let's just wait for some minutes for that disk to be accessible here we go you can see right now the disk is now accessible we have our e drive there which is of course it's going to take with about 449.9 gigabyte here you can see we have about 50 gigabytes of software disk thank you very much for taking your time to watch this video my name is kelvin Johnson. And please don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel for more IT related video. Bye.